What is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna be just cleaning out our yard. We just have a bunch of stuff to do today. Yeah, it's just been raining and our lights started drooping down. So we have yeah. to fix that. And then we have to start getting ready for camping season. Yes, we gotta pull out our tent and set up our, what is that? The wood stove? Yeah, we got a wood stove. So we gotta cut a hole in the tent. We gotta get it set up and ready so we can take you guys camping with us. Dude, I am so excited. I'm not a big camping person, but once you see this tent, I'm your girl. I'm going camping. <laughs> We're gonna grab our tarp, we're gonna grab our tent and just pull the tent out. That thing is so heavy. I mean, <laughs> it's literally gonna take both of us. It's definitely not for backpacking. You don't no. put it on your back, but what are you thinking? Like, what area do you wanna put it in over here? Like, how do you wanna well, set it I'm, up? I'm thinking that we'll have like the entrance of the tent like facing forward and kind of have it more towards the back, push it back so we can kind of have a fire pit out there too. I think that'll be fun as well. Just kind of see how it's gonna be when we're actually gonna go camping. And we gotta figure out the wood uh stove. oven or yes. wood stove and see how we yes. can get that going yep and we just want to be prepared so we're like well whenever we do go camping we're not like oh like what are we doing so we kind of know what's going on as well heavy. <laughs> I'm not kidding. But I bet you it's going to be worth it. This goes right here. Yep. Two entrances so it has to be. So Ollie, come back.
like for real. I don't know why. I think because it was our first time and it was so difficult to actually like figure out all like the pieces and it's not like your traditional tent. Like it's just, it's extra fancy tent and it's huge. But it is huge, that's true. It's huge. And it's actually cooler already inside than outside. So I think when we go camping, we gotta make sure we set it up in some sort of shaded area. Wow, this place is huge. How cool is it? This feels so good and it's not it's been like sunny all day today and it actually feels pretty good in here. It's not like hot. I know, I think if you'd had a fan going somewhere, maybe like somewhere on the bottom where it's cooler and sending the air all around, it's gonna feel really good. And we already have our pre-cut area, so this is somewhat pre-cut. We just have to finish and install a little phalange here yep. and get that stove ready. Yeah, I'm super excited to get that stove and try it out, see what meals we can cook on it, and then like really prepare ourselves for actually going camping because I'm so happy we actually set this tent up now because we kind of know like what the heck we're doing. We weren't, we're not just like driving into a campsite and we're like, what the heck? <laughs> I'm actually super hungry after setting all of this up, this whole tent and... Same, I'm ready to get something on the stove or in the oven. Today's video is sponsored by Cook Unity and we're so excited to show you guys what they sent us. Cook Unity is the first chef to consumer platform delivering freshly prepared pre-selected meals right to your door weekly. Cook Unity connects to a diverse group of talented chefs that cook delicious inventive meals fresh every day in regional macro kitchen, not warehouse production facilities. Chefs cook meals with real ingredients, nothing artificial with humanely raised meat and organic ingredients when possible. Cook Unity chefs offer up a wide range of meals with over seven different dietary preference filters, including vegan, paleo, and gluten-free options. Chefs focus on flavor and inventiveness while leaning into a wide range of different types of cuisines to bring you the best meals possible. Meals are delivered fully cooked, so all you have to do is heat them up. No more cleanup and meal planning. This right here, I just feel like I'm out somewhere at a fancy dinner. Like, look at this. Like, you, it's at home. We're eating this at home, and I'm not kidding. This is so good. Tonight we're eating the pan-seared skirt steak and potato gnocchi with caramelized onions, sauteed cremini mushroom, and kale crafted by Chef Larry and Mark Forgione in Brooklyn, New York. Click on the link in the description below and use my code to get 50% off your first order of Cook Unity meals to try them out yourself. guys next day we had an engagement session last night so we finished that out and then right now what we're going to try to do is we're trying to put this little silicone thing in the tent so pretty much what's going to happen is this ring right here we have to mark it cut it and then feed this through and then this silicone right here sort of helps protect the tent this right here is actually not the chimney it goes on the chimney and it sort of helps disperse the heat a little bit. We want this a little bit lower though, but I'm not gonna read any instructions because that's how real men do things. They don't read the manual and they take two or three trips to Home Depot to figure it out after they mess it up. So that's the route we're gonna take and we're gonna pretty much have to cut this flap right here and cut a little bit of a hole because this one's a bit too small. And it's like a flame proof sort of material that'll help protect our, uh, our chimney. So let's see what happens. <laughs>
fire is all burning so i think we're good to you know go camping pretty much what we're going to do is try to pack this thing away it's supposed to be rain coming and i want to get it away while it's dry with these canvas tents you got to put them away um and if you don't put them away when it's dry this can get wet and it's going to start getting maybe a little mildewy or moldy um our, our fire is going i'm going to try to burn it out let it burn through make sure we're not leaking anything anywhere but this stove is it's just doing amazing if you look right here pretty much the wood's already catching in the center and you can hear it working you know once it once it gets going it gets going it's almost like roaring when i was first starting it up so pretty much next we got to pick a park and then go there get set up and do some camping as always guys follow us on instagram we usually post a little bit more on there about what we're doing or the behind the scenes and then like and subscribe for more content <laughs>